if things have been going well and you run your first program, your LED Eyes program, it should look something like this on the computer. So that you're saying turn off B1, which is the left eye, turn on the right eye, so that happens almost simultaneously, wait for 0.5 seconds, and then turn on the left eye and turn off the right eye, and then wait 0.5. And what you have is that this program will continue repeating. So this is your first program, your LED eyes program, and it's the first one out of a number of programs that you need to complete for this course. So if you get to this point, you should be simulating to make sure it works, and then running that on your robot. And what you'll see when you're simulating, see how the pins are turning on and off? So you know that B1 and B3 are working in this program, and we can stop that simulation because it's just going to keep going, same thing with the program, forever and ever and ever, until we turn the robot off. So you can now program that to your robot. What you need to do, once you finish this program, is to save it. So you've probably got your home screen up like this. It's really important to save your programs with your name and the name of the program. So file, save as, and I'm going to go Moil LED Eyes. So this is your first program. Now you guys need to make sure that you save it to your network so that you can access it in other places and that you're not clogging up the desktop on your particular computer. So it'll come up with your network, which I believe is the H drive. Uh, it'll have your name over here and you can click on that and save it. So once you've saved that, it will then come up with this and this way you can keep track of what your particular programs are so that if you need them later on or when you come to do your dancing or your fighting robot you can get those programs and if you want to incorporate it into the final product.